I'm going to show you how to send an instant message in Teams and create a group chat. You can start a chat anywhere in Teams via the new chat button or the command bar. When you click the new chat button, you'll be taken to the chat tab. Here, you can enter the name or email address of the person you'd like to chat with. You can enter as many people as you'd like here if you want to create a group chat from the start. I'm going to just type in one name here. You'll see that this brings up our chat history. Teams will always keep your message history so you don't lose important information. All I need to do to jump into this conversation is place my cursor in the message box and start typing. Then I can press enter or the send icon to send my message. I can also start a conversation from the command bar by typing in a backslash, which lets Teams know I'm about to give it a command and then chat. I'll be prompted to type the name or email address of the person I'd like to chat with, and then I can type my message right into the command bar. And I can press enter or click the send icon to send my message. To create a group conversation, we can go back to the new chat icon and use this field to type in more than one name. We can also upgrade a current one-on-one -on -one conversation by adding more people on an ad hoc basis. In the conversation, use the Add People icon in the upper right corner. From here, we can search for new participants using their name or email address. When we click on the new person, they're automatically brought into the conversation. That's how you send an instant message and create a group chat in Microsoft Teams.